Welcome back. The people have spoken and some controversial changes are coming to Chickamauga. One involves the demolition of Gordon Lee High School. The other concerns new liquor by the ga uh, glass laws. Uh, Brandon Evans explains. Brandon. Well, Josh and Latricia, voters inside Chickamauga's city limits say they want a historic school torn down and they want their liquor glasses filled up. But not everyone is on board with those measures. I'm shocked. I can't believe it. Holly Sweat only attended Gordon Lee High School for a short time, but she's well aware of its history. The school was built nearly 100 years ago, but safety concerns forced the Chickamauga City School Board to evaluate their options, renovate or demolish. I spoke to the director of the Gordon Lee Alumni Association about the problems the building faces. It was a wonderful facility at the time. It's still beautiful, but it doesn't really serve all the purposes needed for the students today and the students in the future. Tuesday, the vote to borrow $2.5 million from the state passed by a three to one margin. But the other measure that passed was liquor by the drink. I never thought that I would see the day that liquor by the drink would come to pass in Chickamauga, Georgia. And I really don't think that it's necessary. Right now, Chickamauga doesn't have many restaurants within the city limits that would even use the change in law, and even the businesses whose doors are open wouldn't say it's in their future. Personally, I'm not necessarily against something like that, but I know as a community, I don't really see that being a step in the right direction. Some of the people I spoke with today worried that the law could mean more drunk drivers will now be out on the roadways. Back to you. Brandon, thank you. As for the school demolition, no specific timeline has been set as to when the new school will be built, but plans are in the works. We will keep you updated.